when I said I have been decluttering, you guys said that you would like to see some decluttering videos. So today is the perfect day to get started because I have this huge mound of laundry that I am folding and I really have been wanting to go through my dresser and get rid of things that I don't wear or don't need anymore. So I thought I would take you guys along. Um, I'd rather do this before I put all my laundry away. Um, obviously, it's, if it's just been washed, I'm still using it and wearing it. So there's no point um, in putting those things back and then going through it. So I am going to take you guys and um, we're going to go start at my pajama drawer. So let's get started. Okay, so here is my drawer of pajamas. It is not full yet because, like I said, I have a lot of laundry to do. Um, but as you guys know, I have been trying to buy new pajamas and get things that are, I don't know, more attractive looking. So I'm gonna get rid of the things that I don't wear anymore and make room for cuter pajamas. So these pajama pants I just got um, last Black Friday and they're extremely comfortable and I like to just lounge around the house in them so I'm going to keep those. These are black leggings. Um, they probably shouldn't be in my pajama drawer to put those somewhere else. This tank top I got my, at my lingerie shower to go with a pair of shorts, but it like ripped. I don't understand like what the heck. This is when you get, when you buy Forever 21 clothing, that's what happens. So this is going in the trash. These pants are Victoria's Secret. They have pink on the butt, but I just don't really wear these because they're really not that comfortable. They're just like this nasty material, like... I don't know, I just don't, I don't wear them because they don't help to warm me up or anything. Um, you can see the tag, I'm pretty sure that they're like super old. Um, but yeah, I think I got these at like Goodwill or something, they're not even like, I don't know. So I'm getting rid of those. This I also got last Black Friday. Um, it matches this top, it's just like a cute Christmas set, so I'm going to keep that. Um, these pants, I'm not sure if I'm keeping. I'm going to try these on and see how they fit. Um, I might possibly be getting rid of these. These two pairs of shorts I am keeping. You guys just saw them in my Victoria's Secret outlet haul. Um, this shirt I am keeping, but I probably won't keep it in my pajama drawer. It's just a long sleeve shirt that I got from JCLU, I think is what it is. It's a Christian clothing site. So I'm keeping this. Um, it's really comfortable. These I might, I might part with. They are Victoria's Secret. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I might. Mm. These are going to go in the baby pile. These I absolutely love, but I have worn the crap out of them. This is the hole um, where this is supposed to come out of, but for some reason a hole broke through and they came out of this one, so, uh, I probably should get rid of these, but I love them so much. I'm gonna put them in the May pile. This is not working out very well. <laughs> I have these, which I just got for my lingerie shower. These I'm keeping. These I'm definitely getting rid of. Um, I've had these forever. These used to be my mom's. And I just warm the bed all the time. They're just like little cheerleading shorts. I think they're from Sears. Um, yeah, don't need those anymore. This is a cute little nightgown, which I am going to keep. It is very sexy. And it is from Victoria's Secret, so that I'm going to keep. This is a bathing suit cover-up I got forever ago. It still fits. I still really like it. Um, the woman that I used to nanny for bought it for me and um, I just love it but I'm not gonna keep it in my pajama drawer because I never like this is the first time I've seen it in a while I forgot it was in here so I'm gonna hang this up and put it with the rest of my bathing suit um, cover-ups so that is the empty drawer I'm gonna try on my maybe things get rid of the old stuff and uh, fill it back up and I will show you what it looks like Okay, so here is my pajama drawer with everything in it. Now, like I said, I just did laundry, so pretty much everything is folded and put away. I don't think I have anything else except for maybe like a pair of shorts. Um, so everything fits nicely. It closes without an issue, um, and that's great. I love when drawers are not fully stuffed. So um, in here I just have my pants. Um, I don't normally wear pants to bed. I just lounge around the house in them. So they're right here. I have my shorts um, all back here. I have my t-shirts, which um, I don't think they were in here when I was going through some stuff. But um, I have a tank top. 
Um, and then I have two of David's old t-shirts that I sleep in sometimes, so I decided to hang on to those. Um, an old cheerleading shirt that is really special to me, and then just this tank top that's super comfortable. Then here I have all my nightgowns. Um, they're in the front because they're my favorite thing to wear. So I just have all my nightgowns right here. Um, and I still have some room for like another t-shirt, you know, some, you know, whatever. So I do still have some more, more room. Um, so that closes nicely. And then over here are the things that I am getting rid of. I did have a few things that I decided to get rid of after folding my laundry. Um, this is an old t-shirt that I decorated for my best friend's 12th birthday, which was a little difficult for me to get rid of because I've held onto it for so long, but when I put it on, I don't really enjoy the meaning behind it, so what's the point of keeping it? So I'm getting rid of that. I'm getting rid of another cheerleading shirt that really doesn't have much meaning. Um, I'm getting rid of one of these old t-shirts that was David's. I'm going to make sure that he doesn't mind that I get rid of it, but... I've, I've slept in his t-shirts since we started dating, so really when I put them on, they don't have any meaning for me. One of them is just really comfortable, and the other one I just can't get rid of because it does have a little bit more meaning. But this one, who cares? You know, whatever. I don't need it. Um, here's a white tank top that has the same issues as the black one. It's already ripping, and so what's the point of hanging on to that? Um, so I have those two tank tops here. I did decide to get rid of these shorts. Um, those shorts that I already told you this pair of pants and then I did decide to get rid of these pants as well. They're a little tight and they're not as comfortable anymore. So that is what I'm getting rid of. So um, let's see, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine articles of clothing from that drawer. That makes me super happy. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm getting rid of from my pajama drawer. Okay, so I thought that I would also go through my sock drawer with you um, in this video. So over here I have just like my regular socks. These are the tiny no-shows and I also have some random stuff in here and these are my big like fluffy socks. So let's go through them. Um, these socks all fit me really well and I really like them. So I'm going to keep them. So let's see, all these. Oh, these colored ones that David just bought me that I am obviously going to keep since he just got them for me. I have some special running socks in here. Um, let's see. These I am not, well, I don't know. I know for sure that I don't need to keep these anymore. These were old um, cheerleading socks that um, I used to wear for cheerleading competitions. They have our mascot name and then their phone number and stuff on them. I don't need to keep these anymore. So I'm going to get rid of those. Just throw them down there. Um, I have two more pair. I have a gold pair. Um, let's see. These are keeping. Here's another pair. I don't need those. Um, I don't know about these. Let's see what they look like. Hmm, I think I'll keep these. I'll see if I wear them in the next few weeks. Then if I don't, I'll get rid of them. These I wear all the time. I love those. Um, I'm not sure about these socks right here. If I really need to keep them. Gosh, it's hard to do this with one hand. <laughs> um, these are more cheerleading socks. They don't have a name on them or anything, but they're like... I can't really explain cheerleading socks. They're like fluffier on the inside so that they give you more, um, like so you don't have a lot of space in your shoe. I'm going to set these to the side. I don't think that I need them, but for some reason I just like don't want to have no cheerleading socks. But when am I ever going to cheerlead again? Let's get serious. These socks I think I can get rid of. They have like megaphones on them. I think I got them from like Limited 2 forever ago. These I'll hang on to for a little bit longer. And, hmm, uh, yeah, I'll probably hang on to this for a little bit longer. And then I have this little Victoria's Secret little, um, scent thing in here. Let's see. So it smells pretty good. So I'll hang on to that. Over here, I'm definitely keeping all these socks because I wear them to work constantly. So I'm just going to throw these over here because I know I'm keeping them. This, I am all, I'm going to keep all of these. I need to cut them and get them separated, so I will do that. 
this sock um i'm missing the match to it so i'm going to see if i can find it if not i'm getting rid of it this is an ear warmer that i'm going to hang on to because it does get cold sometimes here um, some gloves these are some leather gloves these are my fast flats which i can probably find place for in my closet and then some hankies that do not need to be in here any longer um, and then over here I have more of my fluffier socks um, these have been worn to pieces I think that I can get rid of these keeping these and these and these I just bought over Christmas time so definitely keeping those I'm gonna get rid of those because they're not very comfortable these are my high cheerleading socks I think they're pretty which I think are pretty cool. Keep those. Keep these. Um, uh, do, 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 do. I have these really cute. Be mine. Little like slippers. So I think I haven't really worn them. So I don't know. But they're just so cute. So I don't know what I should do. I think I'm going to hang on to them. And then these are even cuter. Because they have this little rhinestone. Oh, I don't know. I'm going to hang on to them because these are super cute even though, come on, these are all the dead. It's so bad. But um, I think I'll hang on to those. So I'm going to organize my drawer and then I will get back and show you guys what it looks like. Okay, I think this looks much better, much more organized. It makes me feel better. Um, I put all of my colored socks back here, all of my white socks here. And these are all the ones that are just like ankle length. Um, so they're all the same size, but I just separated them by color. Back here is all of my like winter stuff, the gloves and the ear warmers and then this random sock. If I don't find the match for it soon, I'm going to just toss it. Um, and then my little no-show socks. And then my big fluffier ones. Um, the ones I don't wear as often are obviously in the back. These are just for um, when it's super cold. I can wear those with boots. And then these I just wear with boots year-round um, just so I have like a longer sock. So that is what my sock drawer looks like. And then down here are the socks I'm getting rid of. So nine pairs of socks, not bad. Most of them are cheerleading socks. I did decide to get rid of these cheerleading socks. Um, I kept one pair and then I'm getting rid of my old Jaguar cheerleading socks and then three of these different like colored socks. So yeah, so I hope that you guys enjoyed this decluttering video. I will probably film more if you'd like to see more. Make sure to thumbs up this video, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.